This is a porcelain platter that's been hand carved with the different colored slips and it's also been bisque fired and it gives you more than an idea of how the drawing's done but it also demonstrates that after you do all this work and you put it through the bisque firing sometimes you take it out and there's a stress fracture from any number of things I mean probably here it was because of the way this was done or I put pressure on it when I was carving it because this is you know a bit of time here but that'll give you an idea of so what's the uh, recourse for that? Is that something that, that is just personal the territory, or can you do something with this? <laughs> I won't, because to me it's always it's always a, a structure a structure uh -huh. fault. Even if it was used as a decorative piece, it would still be. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't sell it. Probably right. what I'm going to do with it, and I'm sure this is what I'll do with. I'll use it for glaze tests, and mm -hmm. um, you know, I could fire it and put it in a mosaic outside. Something now is this like part nature. of the, the illustration, is it part of the this uh, the latest series with the rocket ships? and? It's kind of a combination of that and um, you know just being outside and, and our trip to Spain and the funny trees that are in Barcelona and I don't know. Did Everything you draw that first stuff. like in a sketchbook? Do no, you have a... I do everything just in the moment. Uh -huh. um, yeah, I, I don't plan a lot. I'll doodle, but um, as far as taking this picture plane and dividing it up, figuring out how I'm going to do it, no. <laughs> it's in the moment. Just in the moment. Mm -hmm. I just sit down and start drawing. Mm -hmm. That to me is the, the fun of it, you know. Um, so that's why it looks like that, I guess. <laughs>